Hey guys, here to do a movie review on Whip It. Um, some sometimes you see a movie and it, it just it has a really deep impact on you. And out of all the movies made, Whip It really um, impressed me. I absolutely love Ellen Page. She really, the first movie I saw her in was the third X-Men, but I actually didn't realize it until later. Um, but I saw her in Juno, and Juno was just a great movie. I've seen that movie so many times. I love it. And I, and I subsequently saw her in Inception and uh, Hard Candy, which she was really good in. And uh, she did not... not fail me in this movie. She was probably better in this movie than she was in Juno, I thought. The movie is directed by Drew Barrymore, which is her directorial doubt. She's in the movie along with uh, Kristen Wiig, Juliette Lewis, Jimmy Fallon, and the movie is basically about um, roller derby. Ellen Page plays this uh, This um, this is kind of like this kid who doesn't really fit in. She's she she's like a punk rocker, you know. She dresses up weird, and you know she she's just trying to find something to fit in. And her mother is constantly making her do these pageants, and she ends up going to this roller derby one day and she finds out that she really likes it. She ends up trying out for the team. And she's only in high school, and she lies about her age and says that she's 21. And she ends up making the team because she's like she's really fast on roller skates, and she ends up, you know, trying her absolute best for roller for the roller derby and roller skating. And then along the way, she ends up meeting this man of her dreams, who is really awesome. And they start it it, start, it turns into a great love story. <coughs> but then she uh, ends up. Di she ends up um, discovering that he kind of cheated on her while he was on a tour for a band that he was in. What happens is it was this point in the movie where he was going to leave for his band tour, and they gave each other they gave each other their own shirts, and she saw some other chick wearing her T-shirt on this picture on the internet. So he comes back, and she ends up breaking up with him, and it it's kind of sad. But then again. Um, glad that she made the right decision and her parent her parents do not approve of this roller skating when they first find out at first they don't know about it but later they find out and they don't like it and uh then there's this thing at the end where the whole the whole point of the movie is about she joins the worst roller skating team and then they end up going to the tournament to face the the rival team and the, the the main rival is Juliette Lewis. Called she's every roller skater has a nickname. For example, Juliette Lewis is, is the Iron Maven, and Ellen Pages is a uh, uh, ruthless Babe Ruthless. And um, they end up losing at the tournament, <coughs> but they're happy that they made it all the way there. And Ellen Pages' character kind of patches up her friendships and all the mistakes that she made and. The movie ends really well. Um, I was really impressed with this movie. I thought, you know, I I only bought this movie because of Ellen Page, and she did not, um, she didn't, uh, you know, fail me. I can really always count on a good movie with Ellen Page. Um, I just I really like Ellen Page. She's probably my favorite actress of our current generation. Um, I do want to see, she was in a Woody Allen movie called uh, From Paris with Love. Heard it wasn't amazing, but I want to see it because Ellen Page is in it. And uh, there was one which she was in with Rain Wilson called Super that I heard was kind of weird, and I want to see that. But uh, I just, I really like Ellen Page. She's one of my favorite actresses. And uh, I guarantee if you liked Juno, you'll like Whip It. It's got that same kind of, high, it's the same kind of high school love story, although Ju Alan Page, when this movie was made, she was 22, and she played a character that was 17. 
Same thing with Juno. I think in Juno she was 20, and she played a character that was in high school. So, you know, it, it's it's kind of almost the same movie, but maybe that's why I like it so much. But, um, great movie for Ellen Page. Highly, highly recommend it if you love Juno, or if you like Ellen Page and you haven't seen this yet. Or, fuck, if you just like a good movie in general. Um... This movie is relatively cheap now. I only got it for four bucks, and uh, it's been out for about four years now. It came out in 2009, and it's based on the book Whip It by Shauna Cross, Shanna Cross, something like that. But very funny, very heartwarming. Um, definitely a movie I think if you're like having a really bad day or a bad week, and you want to watch something, Whip It would be a good choice, or Juno. But Ellen Page, I really hope she does something to win a Best a best Actress Oscar. She really deserves it. I thought she deserved it for Juno, but I don't know if she got nominated for this movie or not, but she should have. But this is my review of Whip It, and thanks for watching.